This 6 inch tall and 13 inch wide 1677 piece Lego pickup truck is a beauty. From the simplistic dark red color to the removable railings, this vintage farm truck costs $119.99 US dollars and $119.99 Euro dollars. I'm Mark and welcome to my channel. Subscribe below before going any further, that way you don't miss another video. Beginning with the truck itself, it has a hood that pops up and can be held up by a hood prop. This allows you to see the beauty of what lies underneath the hood. You have a large V8 motor that is well formed together and a grill in front of the truck that is formed by pieces that I believe may be used as large claws and other Lego sets. There is also a V8 piece that is connected to the middle of the grill, which looks great. The two headlights are nice looking, and the license plate is simplistic and just right for the set. If we turn the truck to the driver's side, you can see a few features. One being the Green Farm sticker placed on the door. You'll also get this on the passenger side door. Another nice feature is the old school gas tank that sticks out of the truck. I honestly think this makes for a very lovely touch, giving it that vintage feeling once again. You also get the black foot railings for the driver to step on on either side of the truck. The side mirrors are circular, but oddly miss any sort of clear pieces to be inserted, which doesn't totally ruin it for me at all, but it is odd. When you open the door, you can see that the interior is a two-tone color, consisting of cream and tan. There is a printed dashboard that is set behind the steering wheel, which by the way, the steering wheel turns the front tires. That's another nice function this truck has. You may notice past the steering wheel that there is a long stick shift coming from the floor of the truck, which is totally vintage, and it's appropriate. If we look at the rear view mirror, you can see that there is a sticker that gets placed there, giving the impression that the truck is driving away from the farm with the sun either setting or rising in the background. If we head to the rear of the truck, you can see a vintage Lego print on the hatch, which looks great, and the hatch does open and close by pulling back the hatch or lifting it up. The rear bumper is simplistic with two small tail lights on opposing sides, and the bumper also holds the same license plate as we see on the front. Taking a look at the railings, they are tanned to replicate wooden railings, and they can be removed as well as reinserted to the sides of the truck bed. They come out with little to no effort and are put back in without a struggle. I have found these very useful to hold all the extra content that the truck comes with, with almost no issues at all. The truck bed is an appropriate size containing both dark red studded tiles and flat tan tiles that I'd assume replicate wooden parts of the bed. The extra content you get to build are the seasonal extras that come with the set. Now all four seasons come with this, so you get parts for summer, fall, winter, and spring. I'd have to say this makes the truck so much more worth buying because displaying any of these parts really make the season you're celebrating in your home a bit more fancy. The summer season comes with two barrels, one holding eight tomatoes and the other holding six carrots. You also get a milk pail to join along with the barrels. For the fall, you get a crate with five pumpkins and a sign that says fresh from the farm. For the winter, you get a Christmas wreath which attaches nicely to the front of the grill, making the truck even more stunning. There's a green and blue Christmas present that sits comfortably on that stud, making that a gift for someone special when that farmer gets home. Last, we have the spring content which comes with a watering can and a wheelbarrow carrying three sets of different colored flowers. You also get on the other side of that sign I mentioned earlier that shows flowers and it says today's pick. Overall, this truck is stunning and it was fun to build. I personally didn't come across any difficulties building it and there were no pieces of the dark red that seemed like it was an off-colored piece to match the rest. The truck is sturdy and it's not something I'm too worried about when it comes to carrying it around. I think the amount of pieces and content it comes with for the price is well worth it and the fact that you can display it to represent different seasons in your home make it even more of a buy. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel and leave a like so that way you don't miss another video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.